Bruins up north collectors here. We're opening up the July baseball crate. Uh, this is the latest baseball crate from the card crate. Uh, this has <clears throat> um, a few packs in it, as always. Uh, hobby packs and then your bonus. Uh, I believe this month I had Finest Stadium Club. Um, pro debut and diamond king yeah pro That's debut and diamond king so all 2018 and then we'll see what our bonus is yeah so these are always a good value this month had some really good products in it so we picked this one up we haven't done one of these in yeah a little it's, while. Been, it's, a, been, it's a while. been a few months so uh thanks to anthony the guys at uh, card crate uh definitely um look them up online uh definitely good value you get you get them delivered right to your door uh it was Thirty dollars plus six dollars shipping. So, yeah. So you get your supplies as always, and we actually like we bring these like so we leave for the national on Wednesday. We last we brought a bunch of these to the national and just kind of carried them around. Yeah, or, or nice. other card shows, or if you're gonna go to a um, hobby store or whatever, just a nice you know, way to kind of carry your your. I'll show this first. Yeah, for your sure. Supplies around. Yep. So here are the products. So there's finest. And there's Stadium Club, Diamond Kings, Pro Debut, and then there's some more info there that I will read later, but if you guys want to read it. And coming in August, Chrome, Ginter, and Optic. That'll be a good month. Yeah, that'll be a good month. So if you haven't opened up Ginter or Optic, those those are pretty decent products. Uh, Optic this year, we opened up a hobby box and did really well. I actually really like the product, um, you know, minus the, the no logos, but... Um, pretty pretty nice product. Yeah, so we got a double, and we have 2013 Panini Prism and 2018 Top Series 2 Hobby Packs. And then the regular packs. We've got a pack of Finest, a pack of Stadium Club, a pack of Diamond Kings, and a pack of Pro Debut. Yeah, if you don't so, remember how the card crate works, you either get a single, a double, double triple, triple, or a home run. run. Um, and I think this month they doubled up uh, on the doubles. I think there are yeah. a lot more doubles. I, I almost want to say you're guaranteed a double. Yeah, I, I want to really say that. Remember, that could but... be right. All right, so the 2013 Panini Prism. I don't honestly don't remember opening this before for sure. I don't remember if I've opened it, but uh, Michael Bourne, David Price, Ricky Henderson, a top prospects, Miguel Sano. He's now a pretty established major leaguer. A rookie of Darren Ruff and a Tyler Cloyd. So I'm pretty sure this pack of Pro Debut has a hit in it because it's quite like it feels... It feels solid? It feels relic -y. Oh, yeah, for sure. There's some cool relics in Pro Debut if I know, you I'm haven't seen them yet. So, yeah, definitely some neat ones. So we got a Tyler Freeman base card. We did a couple boxes of these and got some really sweet relics. And our relic... It's going to be, I think this is Brendan Rogers. Oh, awesome. Piece of the wall. Sweet. Or no, it's Ryan Vallad. I lied. But so it's a, P, a wall sign from Sam Zaplizio Field, Grand Junction Rockies. That's pretty sweet. Not numbered, but I like these. These are pretty sweet. Like just to get a piece of sign from a stadium <clears throat> and stuff. Kind of cool. Yeah, they yeah they definitely did a good job. It, you know, it's not a high end product by by any imagination, but it's uh the relics in there are definitely unique compared to the getting the white relic of somebody's jersey that they wore for two seconds uh, yeah. not a game worn jersey. These are actually pieces of wall, pieces of base, pieces of dirt that you get from the field. So pretty pretty cool stuff. This is a stadium club, and this is, this is a pretty hard product to get a hit out of because they're what eighteen. No. 16 packs in a box, I think 16. Yeah, 16, I think, yep. And then there are only two autos, so tough to get hit out, but really awesome-looking cards. A Rolls Chapman, a Special Forces, Justin Verlander. I love these cards. They're really nice-looking. A uh, Brad Ziegler and a Garrett Cooper. All right, so that does it for my pack, so one hit, not too bad. Yeah, so one, <clears throat> one hit. I mean, there's a lot of times you get zero, zero hits out of this, yeah. so... Um, we'll see what we get out of this this pack here. This is top series uh, two. This is a hobby pack. So once again, the card crate you get all hobby packs. Never, ne it's, there's never retail except for like uh, collector's box stuff. All right, Prez, Ramos, uh, Hedges. There's the Padres card. 
Travis Shaw, Pomerantz, uh, McClure's, uh, Martinez, and Curtis Granderson. So nothing out of that <clears throat> that pack there. Let's not see. surprising, though. Series Diamond two. Kings. This does not feel thick at all. So uh, maybe there's an auto in here. Maybe it's just a base pack. One mine in Otani. Yeah. Otani would be nice. He's in here uh, with autographs. Uh, so uh, Lazar... Laziri. Laziri, yeah, Tony Laziri. So obviously missing out on the, um, you know, mascot names or the the team names. So you get you know Cincinnati, not the Reds, just Cincinnati. Not the mascot um, names, but definitely the team. Well, yeah, they're not all mascots, but uh, Johnny Pesky and Otani. Like all right, that's nice. Not a not a hit, but that's a nice card, a sepia. Yeah. Um, these are. You know, harder to pull. Uh, I don't know. They have much value. They were at first. It was like a twenty dollar card. At first. Yeah, at first it was, yeah, well, it was like a twenty dollar card. So I don't know what what they're going for now. Not but bad, though. I'll take that. yeah, not bad. And of course, he's uh, back uh, playing. At least last I checked in uh, batting. So definitely keep your eye out on Otani. Probably won't be pitching anymore this year, but uh, who knows? We'll see. There is something thicker in here, I think. Yeah, there is. Yep. So, it could be it could be an auto. It could be one of the finest first. Nope, we'll it's see. An auto. All right. So Salvador Perez. Nice. There's you get a the cornerstone. Cody. Stones, yep. You get the auto. cornerstone autograph is usually behind that one. Uh, Chris Archer. Bryce Harper. Then back to our Cody Bellinger. Let's see if we get the camera to focus a little bit better here. All right, let's see here. So it's going to be uh, Sandy Alcantara. He signed the autograph right over the name. Right, so you can see <laughs> you can see the pen right down there. So pretty good. Uh, we got two hits out of this. And nothing crazy. Uh, but And we got the Otani. So I'd say we did rather yeah, well. That was pretty good. That yeah, was a good, good break. Um, anytime you get a hit uh, and a finest hit, they're, they're nice. They're on card. Uh, the finest is very tough product to get one of the bigger names. A lot of a lot of autographs in there, but a sharp looking card. So you see Otani, Sean Sert, the Ryan Vlad, uh, Wall Sign, and this Miguel Sano Prospects card. So that was, a, that was a pretty good break over. Yeah, it wasn't, wasn't anything crazy, but no. definitely better than some we've done. Uh, you know, sometimes you can get. Uh, you know, hitting every pack. Sometimes you get skunked. We've we've had the uh, skunk part a couple times, but it's still fun. Uh, if you don't have a hobby store near you and you're looking to you know break some hobby packs, you don't want to open up a whole box. This this might be a good option for you. So thirty six dollars. Also with the bonuses, you get a chance to uh, get something even you know uh, bigger, greater in your in your box. Um, yeah. There's a chance of a home run. Home run is usually what a, a hobby box. It's always or, a hobby yeah. box. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, check them out. I'm sure if you're watching this now, you, you've probably seen the card crate before or at least heard about it. And, uh, uh, you know, take that as, a, as one option to buy uh, hobby packs if you're interested in doing that, you know, versus buying a whole box. Uh, we don't have a hobby store close to us, so this is a good option for us, and we have fun doing it. comes in the mail, uh, and every month if you do the monthly subscription or you can do it uh, once, uh, you know, whenever you want, once in a while. So that's what we've done. We've done it just kind of when, when the product looks good. We'll probably do it again next month because it looks like it has a good lineup. So thanks so much for watching. Uh, have a great rest of your uh, week. Hopefully you're doing well. There's a lot of good products coming out. If you look at the uh, release calendar, uh, Topps Chrome's coming out uh, real soon, even this week. Um, and there are many other products that are releasing pretty much a rapid fire in baseball and then uh, football as well. So uh, stay tuned for more breaks. We'll be breaking some of those products soon on our channel. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Have fun collecting. And if you haven't subscribed yet to our channel, please do. Also hit the thumbs up button if you like what you saw and make your comments below. All right, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.